Greensburg residents were left blue after a tornado devastated their community last year. But today, K-State students are trying to get Greensburg greener. 49 News Manhattan reporter Annette Lawless explains how a little green will help the community as they rebuild. Sobs roar and sparks fly as these K-State students help polish Greensburg to becoming the nation's first ever green community, where they'll focus on building environmentally friendly homes, offices, and facilities as they rebuild. Architecture student Melody Meek says the effort known as Project Cube will bring pavilion cubes of sustainable living to Greensburg. Each cube is eco-friendly. One cube recycles rainwater, another provides bins for recycling. Students focus on carefully crafting each cube to be able to withstand another weather crisis. Maybe this can start to lay a groundwork of how universities can respond to natural disasters. There are 14 K-State architecture students who are actually participating in this Go Green initiative where they're going to bring these products like those right behind me down to Greensburg, Kansas at the one year anniversary of that F5 tornado that devastated them a year ago. Though the students have spent two weeks building the project, many say the lessons learned from the experience will last a lifetime. Bring their, their town into the 21st century and give the, the high schoolers that are there now and future generations a reason to stick around. Pretty rewarding to, to know that we actually didn't just draw something up, but we, we can stand and, and touch this and imagine the people of Greensburg see the excitement on their faces, and I think that'll be something that we'll take with us probably for the rest of our lives. But no matter how excited the community of Greensburg is, these students can't help but paint a happy smile on their own faces. In Manhattan and at Lawless, KTKA 49 ABC News. The students of Project Cubed will deliver the finished product to the community on May 4th. Students have been planning the overall project for two semesters.